I have been on a quest to find my next favorite pillow. If you guys know, I've reviewed a lot of pillows, a lot of crazy pillows, and this might be the next best pillow. I don't know yet, but this is called the Matrix Pillow, and uh, apparently this is built up of a bunch of squares and it's designed to sleep at any angle. Do you want to know what it is? I'm not really sure. There's some instructions here. Let's see what this thing looks like though. So if you guys remember, we reviewed the purple pillow, which was like 100 pounds. I don't know, just all kinds of crazy pillows. Every single week I'm trying to review a new pillow. Check that out. Look at that. Oh, okay. Some sort of Kickstarter campaign on this one. You can check that out below if you're interested. Ugh. Oh, you can, you can see it rising from the ashes. Look at that. It's actually quite thin. It's called the F1, F2 Sleep Pillow. And we have an interesting logo right there. And I guess it's made up of a bunch of squares. I gotta, I wish I could, oh, there's a zipper right here. Oh, so you don't really have access to the actual foam. But if I, if I feel it down here, it's actually interesting. There's a bunch of squares and it's super lightweight. This whole thing is really light. So let's test it out here. Okay, it's been about 10 minutes. It's inflated about twice the size. And if I look on the actual website here, they give you a whole demonstration of what it actually looks like. Now this, again, this is a Kickstarter campaign. So it's brand new to the market. Automatically adapts. All right. Side, back, stomach. We have to try, we have to test all these out. Wow. Cubes, okay. They look like triangles. Huh. So let's try out the different sides here. So here is the Matrix pillow. As you can see, it's pretty thin actually, and it feels really nice laying on my back. My head's kind of floating, but it's not like I'm tilted up. And I'm actually reviewing the uh, pillow cube right here. Now this, you're gonna see a video on this, but this is only designed for side sleeping. So it's designed to fit the shoulder corner here. So you can see, this is just a perfect pillow for sleeping on your side. You can't really sleep on your back with the pillow cube because it's an angle, it's too angled up. So, um, you know, this is, I'm gonna get back to this in the future, but I wanna see if this matrix pillow actually can do every side. So we know it, it feels good like here. Okay, let me feel the side here. Now it feels a little thin on my side. It doesn't fill this corner. Um, but it's very similar to my favorite pillow. Now this is my absolute favorite pillow. This is uh, kind of like my benchmark. I've had it for 10 years. It's, it's almost the same exact size, except this has more of a curve to it. But I'm really impressed how close I'm getting. Does it feel good on the stomach? It's kind of strange. You can, you can almost feel the cubes on one side. So if you don't like that cube feeling, I guess you could flip it over. So the, 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 the triangles are only on this side, not on this side. I think if I fold it in half, then all of a sudden it's like a pillow cube. So this is mimicking my pillow cube experience. So really I could sleep on every single corner. This is pretty good too. I think a lot of people will like it, but some people, again, won't like the triangle feeling and some people won't like how light it is. You know, it's super light. Um, as you, if you compare this to my purple pillow, this is, you know, a 10 pound pillow. They're the same size. They have the same volume, but this has like 20 times the mass. So, you know, they, they both have kind of pros and cons. This might be too light and this is probably too heavy for some people but it is kind of nice that you can fold it, move it. Um, it has a really elastic cover here. You can see it's stretchy, breathable. I question how strong this will be. You know, I don't know if I would put this to the washer. You can wash it though, it has a zipper, so you can wash this part. But obviously I would just probably wash my pillowcase first. Um, overall, I think it's a really cool minimalistic design. I just, um, I'm wondering how long this is gonna last. You know, I'm wondering if one of these squares will cave in but it is kind of cool how it can kind of adapt to any shape you want. If I compare it to my favorite pillow, they're almost the same size. They're both really squishy. You can kind of see this. They both are kind of that squishy foam. You know, they both kind of have this kind of curve to it, which I seem to really prefer. So this is actually a very similar to my favorite pillow. And um, when I compare it to the supporty back here, 
or the spinal line here, you can see they both kind of have these curves. This is just an extreme version where this is better for all positions. This is only great for sleeping on your back, you know, so maybe the, maybe the pillow cube is only great for sleeping on your side. This spinal line is only good for sleeping on your back. And this is kind of somewhere in between. That's kind of what I'm getting at. 24 hours later. All right, guys, it has been a whole night with the bed. Yes, I sleep with my, my polos on. Don't judge me. I mean, you can tell because my voice is deeper. But the pillow is pretty good. I, you know, I was sleeping this way and this way, and I didn't even notice the pillow, which is probably a good thing. Um, I'm thinking because, you know, the pillow is really lightweight, so I can move it very easily. You know, um, I don't know if it blew me away, but I don't have neck pain. And um, I just think, yeah, it was a pretty good experience. There's not really like a lot to say about it. Um, I think maybe if it was just a little bit thicker in the middle, that'd be perfect for me, but I'm pretty darn impressed. Back to you, James, from the past. So I guess the question is, is this Matrix pillow gonna replace my favorite pillow? And right now I can't honestly answer yes or no. I do think it's interesting because when I move my head, I can kind of feel the weight changing a little bit. Um, it, it, it definitely, I don't know, there's a different there's a different feel to having like, you know, cutouts. Um, some people, like I said, will love that. Some people probably won't. Um, and again, this is a Kickstarter campaign, so I'm not sure the full, the full price. They just sent it over, said give us your honest review. Um, if this is $30, I'm gonna say it's a buy. If it's like 50, I'm gonna say yeah, it's not a buy, it's not worth it. Um, I think this is a great pillow, but I don't know how high quality it is. I don't know if it's gonna last a long time. So I think $30 is a fair price. Um, if you guys have any questions, let me know. Let me know if I should try any other pillows and um, leave a comment below if this pillow is right for you. You guys can check out more mattress re reviews right here, more pillow reviews right here, and you can subscribe right here. Peace.